To me, a fight is not a fight until there's resistance, until there's something to overcome. Something to overcome. Everything's unpredictable with him, so we're just prepared for everything. We have what we need to do, and, and uh, hey, bottom line is we have to take him to the ground. He has to keep his stand up. If we decide to stand up, it's not going to be our, in our advantage. If he decides to take it to the ground, it's not his advantage. So it's a classic stand up, take you down type scenario, but it's not as easy as a grappler versus you know, uh, 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 MMA guy, striker, it's not, it's, it's, we got to play the whole game. Dressed up for the funeral. <laughs> there you go. Up, little D. Good. How you feel? Let's go, 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 <laughs> we have to play the stand-up game, we have to play the grappling game, you know, we have to play it all in order to do what we need to do, and we've been training and we've been working, the mental and the physical, I felt we uh, definitely won the mental game, we didn't get involved in any mind games with him, and that agitated him more than it got us. First of all, uh, grounded opponent. In Nevada, a grounded opponent is one hand supporting weight. When we're talking about supporting weight, we're talking about flat or fist. We don't want to see fingers. Yeah, that's a good head. <laughs> okay, so the back of the head, we're talking about the nape of the neck is what I'm most concerned with. And the strip here. So imagine a line at the top of the ears all the way around, and the strip here. The below here is a fair blow. It's behind the ears, but it's above that ear line. This right here is a foul. Most important, if I say fight back, that means I'm working. Do something that makes sense. If I say work, that means I'm about to stand you up or pull you off the fence. Okay, good look at your nails. Cool. All right, looks good to me. Any questions for me? Okay, I'll see you all soon. Good luck and good skill. Thank you guys so much. Thank you for coming. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you so much. going into this, I think, a little bit ahead, just a teeny bit, but sometimes that's all you need, just a little bit. And we're going in there with that relaxation, confidence of knowing that now it's time, cage closes, you know, now it's now it's time to do his thing, and, and I know Habib is going to go out to uh, do exactly what we've been preparing for. I have no doubt about it, but I'm expecting a war. I don't, I don't expect anything less than a war, because it, to me it's a discredit to how great of a fighter Connor is, to to underestimate him, and I'm not underestimating him one bit. He is a super, super talented. Super, he's a great fighter, so we're prepared for a great fighter. Yes, dude. That's right. That's what we do, baby. Come on, baby. Over and around, baby. Over and around. Over and around. Let's go, champ. Let's go, boy. Kick some ass. Let's go, boys. All right, fellas. Kick some ass. Let's go. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. It's all right, it's all right.